Good afternoon and thanks for joining us. I'm Judy Simpson. Vermont has lost a scholar and across the fence has lost a very, very good friend. Late last month, University of Vermont Extension professor Bob Parsons passed away. Bob was an agricultural economist. He was known to a generation of students as well as farm families all across our state. Bob loved education and was a fan of hard work. He was fond of saying, love your work, work your love, and get your work done. I spoke with Bob on Across the Fence every few months for the past 15 years. I always learned something new every time I sat down with him. Bob was always teaching in the class and around our region. Across the Fence's Keith Silva tells us more. Just come walking slowly right across. Okay. Go ahead. So how many acres do you have here all together? If you were fortunate enough to spend time with Bob Parsons, you quickly learned about his passion for farming and the land. We traveled with Bob from dairy farms and apple orchards to a vegetable business, and once we even visited a cheese cave. Could that have a major impact on your business here, or are you just yeah. really... Bob understood connections, how people are tied to the land, and how generations of families relate to one another how families try to work towards the same goal, but often see it from different perspectives. Bushy's about the truck, getting work on the truck, but I do need to pick up that You know that there's saying among attorneys, there's a lot of towns that are too small for one attorney, but there's no town small enough for two of them. Starting in 1990, Bob headed up UVM Extensions, transferring the farm workshops. Leading from the front, Bob took farmers through estate planning, taxes, and how to choose a business model that was uh, the Mr. best Perler's fit for each farm, back. He can maybe make those talking with farmers. Like That's where Bob was at his best. Hello, I'm Bob Parsons, University of Vermont Extension Ag Economist. Not every farmer could take time off to attend a workshop, so Bob made sure the workshops came to them. With the Transferring the Farm video series, Bob, with his friend and colleague Jesse Richardson, created over 20 videos on topics like development rights, debt and equity, and leasing berries, uh, sugar bush trees. The series also includes case studies. Bob knew he could give farmers advice, but he also knew that farmers like to hear from other farmers. So that's what he did in the field and on set. And the ability to pay bills as they come due is just so important for any type of business, whether it's a TV. People who've mastered that Bob's passed on, but he's not gone from Vermont. The legacy he's left in the classroom and on the working landscape indoors.